This is Kara with Presenter Media, just walking you through to how to confirm what version of PowerPoint you have, as well as confirming that this presentation is playing properly. The first step to do is to find the presentation on our website, download the 2007 version, which is going to be the second link down. It's going to ask you where you want it to save. In our case, we're saving to the desktop. We've already done this once. Now we have it downloaded. I'm not going to open it by double clicking because we do have an older version of PowerPoint which will end up trying to open the presentation. If you have PowerPoint 2007, you're going to notice that you have the office icon in the upper left hand corner. Click on that and go to open. Locate the file and then play the slideshow. Now I am changing ours to set up to play in an individual window. This makes it so we're able to see the presentation like this instead of having to have it go full screen. Now you can see in the background we do have the items animating properly. Another option that we do have is you can download this directly from our add-in and the item is 8372. You can type that in and it's automatically going to match the version of PowerPoint that you have, which is something that's very convenient if you don't have PowerPoint 2010. This is a great way to make sure that you are downloading one of the older versions of the template. All right, so here we have our second risky tightrope. You can tell this is the one that we opened from the add-in by it just being presentation two because it saw this is just being inserted. Again, we're going to go to our slideshow, set up and browse by an individual window. And we are confirming that this is playing. Now us having our presenter media add-in on the side is just something that we left open for this. You can close it just by hitting the X and it'll go back to that full window mode. Now, if you're trying to play the presentation and it's not playing, some things to take into consideration. First, make sure that's saved as a PowerPoint presentation .pptx. If you notice it is saved as a PowerPoint 97 to 2003 .ppt file, your animations will be deleted and they'll be replaced with images or PNG files. If you use save as, it's critical to go to the PowerPoint presentation on top as opposed to that PowerPoint 97 to 2003 presentation. Next, if you want to confirm whether or not the video is actually being able to be played, go to View, Slide Master, locate the video, click on the video, go to Movie Options, and select Preview. Simple as that. That's how you can check the video to be able to make sure that it is able to play. Now, if you can go through these steps, let me know which part is not working for you, and I will attempt to help you from there.